So, uh, gear oil in the bonzer doesn't look very good. Uh, I've already had a little incident where we overflow the barrel. Um, there's a little bit more in it than it's supposed to be. I thought a 5 litre tub would catch the whole lot of it, but did not. Like this, that's all the oil. It's pure, I like to call it Bailey's, but it's not Bailey's. Um, you see where there's pure water flowing out as well? If you can catch that with the camera. Um, I don't even think that stuff would burn if you wanted to burn it. Uh, can't think what I'd use it for, but I'm um, going to have to get it out of, out of the gearbox anyway. Um, bit of a mess here now to clean up when I move back. A couple of bags of sand or whatever. Uh, a couple of bags of concrete dust maybe. But um, yeah. That is a proper mess. Um, nasty, nasty, nasty stuff. So, if the gear sticks out of it anyway, that's the problem is those gear stick gators are pretty much like little funnels, uh, funneling nasty water down into the gearbox and making the gears a little bit sticky as well, they're hard to change. Uh, but it does look quite clean in there. Uh, no big rusties up the top of the gearbox or around the bottom I don't think. Um, I think the plan now is to completely drain the box and I'm going to fill it up with diesel and run it just idle with diesel in it and try and wash off that shit and oil off the um, off all the gears and oh we'll figure out what to do with that other mess anyway um i have to move this back and try and clean out that mess underneath so that's what we're doing on a sunday <laughs> around here um a few beers for later maybe but uh We'll just get that done and I'll cover up the gearbox then so nothing else gets back into it and that's our mission for today um, we've already done the hydraulics um, I cleaned out all the hydraulic oil yeah some nasty 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 stuff yeah uh, it's probably going to be a little bit higher than that, maybe with a, a third of a barrel. So obviously there was too much in it, like because there's a lot of water. But um, if anyone has idea, any idea what we're going to do with this mess, I know I could just send it to recycling, but um, maybe it could be used for something. <laughs> I don't know what snot or something. What would you call it? Snot, Mickey? Oh well, God, no! What would you call it? Snots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's nasty, nasty oh stuff. Oh, uh, at least they're standing up in a pile. But uh, yeah, fair, that's that's what happens when you when your gearbox gets full of oil over years and years and years. Um, as I said, this was backed into a, a hedge and it was used as um, a lift. But um, some chunky gears in there, and some junk, chunky shafts. Uh, hopefully they're not junky. Um, Needle burns don't like that stuff. <laughs> Most stuff doesn't like that. Um, yeah, but all in all now, I think she looks pretty clean in there. There's your two selectors for a reverse, forward, and it's like a second gear. And then you have a high and low. So that's just forwards and backwards. Um, but she is a little bit sticky getting into a second gear. So... I'd imagine that's got something to do with it. So we'll see when she's all cleaned out and see what happens. Um, yeah, I'd done the video yesterday, but on a different phone. But the microphone thing must be blocked up on it because it didn't work out. So, that's, is it stopped flowing? No, it keeps going. Just keep going, yeah. <laughs> Scrape out this nasty stuff. It doesn't really want to flow it's all so far, it just layers the side of the oak. Yeah, it's mad stuff. Disgusting. Maybe someone in the comment section could tell us what we could do with that. Maybe someone um, else put it in the tractor. I know I've boiled up, I've boiled water off oil before, but that's not going to happen. 
Um, you'd need some fucking fire to get the, um, excuse me, language, but, um, to get the water out of that. Uh, I've tried to uh, blow torch and it won't even burn. So, that's a bad sign. It's probably 80% water, and I'd say some sort of really thick gear oil, like 90 weight or 100 weight gear oil. I think body fillers. I think body fillers, yeah. Uh, maybe there's a plaster out there I'd like to have a go and see what he thinks um, Because you could use this like for a hardball It's very like gypsum hardball And she's starting to slow down well, there's a few civics That's in a there, good that sign, huh? Yeah. Isn't that a great sign of starting to look at the mess that we've made we We're taking the gear sticks off and we forgot to check the barrel and it was absolutely overflowing Dang Ah well that's what happens, you can try to do two or three things at the same time. So it's going to be fun to clean this up. As I say, it's mostly water, so I don't the EPA will have a word with us. Um, or Greta, or any of the rest of them, you know what I mean? Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> anyway, that's a little Sunday video. Alright. Uh, please like and subscribe. Um, we'll do some more videos on the bonder and we get her all sorted. I hold up all the masks and the boom. All that yesterday, so she's flying up and down out new oil in it. Um, it's happy enough, yeah. I think. Anyway, over and out.